Ladies and gentlemen, do you see these two beautiful, 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 be beautiful big eyeballs? You do, don't you? You do? Okay, cool. That's good. But well, while I have your attention, I need you to leave a like on this video. But not just any like. I need you to like and subscribe. We are playing Tower Defense. Now, we've done a couple of these videos in the past. If you've seen them, you've seen them. If you haven't, let's just go ahead and get into it. This is Minecraft Tower Defense. Probably one of the coolest maps I've ever seen. Now, I know I say that about a lot of maps, but this one is just... The coolest of its category, if that makes sense. Let's pick a level that we have never played before, but also one that's not impossible, like level 10. <laughs> 65 waves. We've done the ice one. We haven't done the castle one, but this one looks really difficult. We have not done the nether. Mm, we might have to do the nether. Yes, let's do the nether. This nether one has 35 waves, okay? So it looks like we have, oh my gosh, we have two endings and it's actually a portal. Can we go through it? Oh, wow, this looks interesting. Oh my gosh, this map looks hard. Look how small it is. The mobs spawn right there and they can either go to this portal or this one. That's not even that far. Literally, they spawn in and, it, and they literally just run right there and then boom, I lost a life. Oh, this is going to be a hard level. Okay. All right, I'm going to go ahead and start off with two sheep towers because I only started off with $30. So we'll start off with two sheeps. Next wave. Here we go. Wave number one. All right, sheeps. Show me what you got. I know I use you guys as like a bed sometimes and I get you, I, I get all the wool from you, but like I need you guys to protect me now. I've never been protected by a sheep before, but... <laughs> Today. All right. Well, oh my gosh, we have $300. How do we get that much money from wave one? We already got $300. Okay. I'm, I'm okay with that. I'm totally okay with that. All right. We're going to go ahead and do a blaze tower right there. Do another blaze right there. And then we'll do a sheep tower over here. Oh my gosh. I don't know how we got that much money from the first wave. All right. Here we go. Wave number two. They're flowing in. Come on. Is that all you guys got? Really? I mean, it is wave two, but still. We need to start upgrading these guys soon. That's why I want to focus on, because we have enough towers. I mean, we're on wave two, and we already, we already have five towers. Kind of ridiculous, honestly. But let's go ahead and start the next wave. We're going to focus on upgrading that dude first. The fire tower right there. Oh, no. They're actually kind of getting through a little bit. Okay. How much does this dude upgrade? Oh, I don't know, but I just upgraded him. Next wave, we got our upgraded fire tower now. Now we do need to focus on the invisible mobs because I know those guys are coming soon. So I think I'm going to save up 300 gold and I'm going to go ahead and just buy the super beacon so I don't have to replace it. Get that super beacon and we'll put it over here like back in the corner, like one of these spots. So it really doesn't take up too much room from where our firepower is going to be, if that makes sense. I don't know. I just love tower defense games. They're so, so much fun to me. Some people hate them and they think they're boring, which I totally understand. You guys might love them. And as I was a kid, I would always play Balloons Tower Defense. I actually still play it today. I have the game on my laptop. I still play it today. Balloons Tower Defense is probably one of my favorite tower defense games like to ever exist. And if you guys know what I'm talking about and you play it, oh, you know what I'm talking about. All right, enough about Balloons Tower Defense. Let's go ahead and get the, uh, wait, there's a chicken tower. Oh! I didn't mean to buy that. Flip. I seriously do not mean to buy that. Oh my gosh. You've got to be kidding me. Can I sell it? 150. Oh my gosh. Now I need two more dollars. I need two more dollars to buy the... Okay, there it is. Super Beacon. All right. Super Beacon has placed... Okay, so this Super Beacon... Oh my gosh, we literally placed it at perfect time because I just saw invisible mobs that came in. Super Beacon, for those of you guys that don't know, is going to make the invisible mobs visible. Because once you get farther into this game, invisible mobs start spawning and our towers can't see them. So they literally just walk through and go to the end. Doesn't matter if you have the best towers, you have to have one of these beacons. All right, let's go ahead and start the next way here. Look, there's the invisible mobs right there. They're completely invisible. But now, since we have the super beacon, all our towers can see the invisible mobs, which is good. We have 25 lives. We're on wave eight. I'm feeling pretty good about this one. I'm feeling pretty good. I think we're going to win this. Only, I think there's only 40. Oh, victory's 35. The chicken tower heals nearby towers. Okay. I'm okay. I'm just going to focus on firepower right now. I'm going to go ahead and do a witch tower here, I guess. And then I'll put another one right there because this side kind of needs more firepower. Next wave, wave number nine. Ooh, got a ton of invisible dudes coming in. Skeletons to be exact. Oh, that dude almost got past our defenses. We haven't lost a single life yet and I want to keep it that way throughout the whole entire video. I don't... Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Really? Literally right when I say... Why didn't you do anything? You're terrible. My sheep tower was destroyed. Great. Great. Oh, now my fire... Great. Great. Lovely. Absolutely lovely. Okay. Oh, now are these guys going to get through? Oh, now you're going straight through, aren't you? Oh. Oh, love you too. Bye. See you guys later. Now I have 21 lives. Oh, now I have 20. Oh, my flipping... Oh. Ah, I don't know what to buy yet. Hold on. This is stressing me out. I can buy a bomb plus for 400 gold? 
blows up enemies, that's not worth it. We got four new fire towers. And the one that blew up was upgraded too. That makes me so angry. That's fine. We have a lot more firepower now. <laughs> Get it? Because they're firepower fire towers we got fire power <laughs> all right bring it on zombies only wave 10 and i got way more fire power i just pressed this thing that said zoom out and it zoomed me out above that was actually pretty sick so it's like a tower defense game when you click that i didn't even know i could do that all right i'm gonna go ahead and up this one and then I'm going to do the next wave, fast forward it on times four, and then zoom out. Check this out. That's so cool. Let me zoom in a little bit more. There we go. So now it looks like an actual like tower defense game because you're like on that bird's eye view. And now I'm back down here. Okay, whatever. Cool. I guess you only get the zoom out feature just for a little bit. It's not for the whole entire wave. Makes sense because there's no way I can get down. I'm actually stuck up here. All right. 220 or 233 gold. Don't mind if I do. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to sell you. Sorry, buddy. And I'm going to sell you. Sorry, buddy. And I'm going to go to the shop, and I'm going to buy two more of these. I'm going to place one here, place one here. There we go. Now we're talking. Ooh, got some invisible mobs coming through. Oh, my gosh. These invisible guys stress me out. Okay, so my goal is to fill up the whole entire map with these fire towers and upgrade them to the max. I think that's what I'm going to do. I mean, come on. I'm in the nether level. Might as well, you know, have some nether spirit. And I got plenty of room for more fire towers, like plenty and the fire towers are pretty op i mean let's be honest there we go let's get another one come on we almost got enough there we go another one yeah let's go let's move the whole map only if i could put one right there too i don't know why it doesn't let me put one right there Ma, oh these fire towers are absolutely wrecking the only thing that i'm worried about is when the creepers come in the creepers stress me out we're on wave 13 right now we have 35 waves to go to beat this whole entire thing i don't know if i want to keep them oh what the flip was that what in the world just happened? How do I fight those things? They weren't invisible. They were just extremely fast. The witch tower didn't even fight him either. I have no idea how to fight those things if they come back because I could see them. They were visible, but they were just so fast. That they skipped every single tower. Maybe I have to have upgraded towers. What? How? What the flip? Whoa, I didn't know they came from there. Whoa, 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 Oh my gosh, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. There's nothing I can do about it. I don't have enough money. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. What the flip just happened? Oh my gosh. You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. I didn't know they even came from this way. Literally just almost lost all of my lives. Uh, I have eight now. I had like 20 something. Oh my gosh. I didn't even get a warning would have been nice. Okay, so now we have mobs coming from this way and this way. And then we have two endings. So we have this ending and wait, is that a heart right there? Oh, I gained a life. Can you do that every, every, uh, every round, please? I think I'm literally glitching the game. Wait, wait, wait. Look, look, look. Look how short the waves are. Look at that. That was way 20. Wave 21. Now it's already over. Wave 22. Oh, now wave 22. What? Wave 22 is over already? Is that really how short the waves are? I don't know if I broke the game or what. I feel like I definitely did. There's no way wave 22 is that easy. That's almost as... Oh. That wave was almost just as easy as wave one. I don't know. It beats me, but I mean, that's if that's the wave, that's the wave. I ain't complaining. A majority of the mobs are honestly coming from this spawn more so than this one. So I'm going to focus on upgrading these guys over here more. Oh, I need 250 gold. Okay, 250 gold to get this guy to his max strength. I'm totally okay with that. There we go. Okay, so this guy's fully upgraded now. Oh my gosh. We're on wave 26 right now. 26 seems to be easier than the last 20 waves so i don't really know what's going on but hey i'm not complaining oh wait never mind i changed my mind that's a lot of zombies oh my gosh oh my gosh those guys aren't even fully upgraded i've upgraded them three times i swear if one of those creepers <gasps> no no which one was destroyed which one okay that one's fine that one wasn't even upgraded oh buddy oh buddy how much is the witch tower to upgrade the witch tower isn't even doing anything he's lit bro look at him not shooting a creeper. Wait for it. Look, he's not doing anything. Just standing. You know what? It's time for you to go, buddy. I'm sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What just happened? It sold my beacon tower, not the witch tower. You guys saw me click on the witch tower. I looked over there and my beacon tower was gone, which means every mob that just came in through that wave was all invisible. And they literally just walked past every... Why? This is the thing about tower defense maps. You goof up on just one little thing. And I didn't even goof up on that. I clicked on the witch tower, but for some reason it sold the beacon tower and the witch tower. That was super, super weird. Oh my gosh. Let's try level one. We've actually never done 
level one. All right, well, here is level one. This is the first level. Let's do it. Let's just, we've never done it, so why not? Why not give it a try? It's probably gonna be extremely slow, but that's okay. Already got a fire tower. Let's go. Fire tower, yeah! Can't believe that glitch happened. Why did that happen? That last round was just so, like, weird in the first place. It was just super weird because we had, like, four waves where only, like, two zombies spawned every wave, and we're on, like, wave 20. Two zombies don't spawn on wave 20. That doesn't make any sense. And then I try to sell the witch tower, and it sells the beacon, too, and and then, of course, the wave that I start, all the mobs are invisible. So I instantly die because I sold the beacon tower. And the beacon tower allows for the mobs to become visible. And uh, I'm just mad. I'm triggered. I'm sorry. All right. Come on. Let's speed this up a little bit. These mobs are so slow. So incredibly slow. Here we go. Oh, wait. I didn't know I had an extra sheep tower on me. Oh, well, now we got fire towers. Okay. This is going to be so easy to beat. Freeze enemies. I will. Margit, get to work. Oh, come on, buddies. We got, ooh, diamond armor now. Once they make it past Margit, then I'll be like, okay, you know, maybe I should worry a little bit. Oh, flip, those dudes are invisible. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh, flip where I put it. Oh, flip, I need another. Oh, get wrecked, nubs. But my fire tower isn't doing anything. Oh, there he goes. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right, let's go ahead and fast forward that. Told, I didn't know they were going to come in that early. That was really early. Wave six, and we already got invisible mobs. Like, GG, you guys need to come. Calm down, please. There we go. We got so many fire towers. It's honestly ridiculous. We're already on wave seven. And look how many fire towers we have. You do get a lot of money. Like, you, you get quite a bit of money. I can already buy three, almost four more. All oh, these dudes are coming in quick. Okay. Okay. We ain't messing around this round. We are not messing around. We are not messing around. I'm, so, I'm telling you guys, the whole entire map is going to be fire towers. I think we should replace this beacon with a super beacon, though. So let's save up for that real quick. Oh, my gosh. What the flip are those things? How do I beat them? Oh, wait. My fire towers are attacking them. They're just extremely... Those guys are just extremely strong. They have like 25 plus health. Kind of ridiculous, honestly. Because these diamond skeletons only have like 10 health. Yeah, and all these zombies with the leather armor, they have like one or two hearts. Jeez. Okay. All right. Let's buy the super beacon. And then let's go ahead and sell this one. We'll put the super beacon right here, which is pretty much the middle of the map. Should cover the whole entire map. Four more fire towers. Oh my gosh. You've got to be kidding me. I have so many fires. All right. We have so many fire towers. Look at this, guys. It's actually ridiculous. Let me zoom out real quick. Oh my gosh. There's so many fire towers at the end. We got to replace all the sheep towers with fire towers, though. We'll do that in a second. Once we get enough money, once we get around four to five hundred dollars. Don't mind if I do. All right. Looks like we're selling all these sheep towers in a second. I'm going to wait for this wave to be over, though. We might be able to get a wither tower if this wave keeps going. We're already at 500 bucks. We only need a thousand. All right. Oh, no, nope, that's the end of the round. Okay, so let's go ahead, sell this one for, oh my gosh, I only get 11 gold from these dudes. I mean, then again, they are 15 bucks to place. This is the cheapest tower you can buy. There we go. Okay. All right. So we sold all the sheep towers. We now have $600, which means we can buy six fire towers. All right. One, two, three four five do i do i even have room for another one? Oh my gosh that's my last space okay so now every single space is taken with the fire tower except for the beacon and the ice one that's right here that is ridiculous guys look at this look at this there's so many fire towers oh those little dudes are coming through again they're so quick they're so incredibly quick it's ridiculous all right now it's time to upgrade every single fire tower all right i'm gonna start with you could you imagine playing this but you have every single like every single slot on the map is fire towers but they're all like fully upgraded we're already on wave 12 now oh my gosh there's chickens what? How are those scary mobs? It doesn't make any sense. There's so many invisible dudes. All right. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade you and you and you. <laughs> I just upgraded like four dudes. These guys are getting wrecked in the beginning. Oh, I'll take some of that. 100 gold. I'll upgrade you. <laughs> Haven't seen any creepers yet, but that's really, really good. I figured we'd see creepers by now, but that's good. I don't, I don't want to see creepers. Oh, right when I say that. The creepers spawn. Of course they do. Oh my gosh. One of my fire towers are gone. No. Okay. So I want to replace one of these fire towers with a wither. Probably this one right here. So I'm not going to upgrade this one anymore. That's if we get far enough because we're already on wave 14 and the, the game ends on wave 20. So... Oh my gosh. These dudes are so... Oh, it's so laggy, guys. I'm sorry. It is so laggy. These guys are making it through. I don't know how to beat those guys. Go around upgrading all these dudes. Here we go. 
We're increasing all the range, which is good. The first upgrade for the fire tower and the first upgrade for most towers just increases the range. It allows the towers to shoot a lot farther than they normally would. So instead of this tower probably not being able to reach the track, now it can reach it and now it's effective. That's probably what it does. Oh my gosh, both of my fire towers are dead down there. All right, let's upgrade all these dudes right here. Upgrade, 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 upgrade. I got another fire tower destroyed. Are you serious? Oh my gosh, the whole beginning. Maybe we should just leave the beginning empty. Fast forward again all right now let's start double upgrading dude so these guys right here let's upgrade this one twice damage increase now he does a lot more damage which is good that's what we want okay now we can almost upgrade this dude wait for it there we go no 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 not doing it not doing it not doing it heal 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 up these guys oh my gosh i'm not losing another flipping tower it is not happening not happening nope nope Nope. I just spent so much money on healing those dudes. It's actually ridiculous. We should put a bunch of sheep towers in the beginning because if the sheep towers accidentally get blown up, because what the creepers do is they act like, you know, normal creepers. The closest person to them is going to get blown up first. So these sheep towers are basically just going to be our towers that get blown up a lot that I don't really care about, which kind of makes sense because the sheep towers will just blow up and then we can replace them and they're super, super cheap. Instead of these towers blowing it up and it costing us another three, four hundred dollars to replace because all these towers are upgraded as well. Oh my gosh, so many upgrades. I need 250 gold for this dude. I got Got another sheep tower but i don't know where to put it <laughs> i don't have any room there's literally no room for it i need to upgrade this dude he can have farther range there we go oh this is wave 20 this is the last wave guys last wave oh flip oh flip i'm so done no 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 come on i swear if i lose on this i don't know how to beat the oh look i just beat him i beat two of them okay that's good wait oh victory yeah you completed 20 waves and you have 18 lives left. Sweet. Oh, and I also got an Illager tower unlocked. So I got a new tower. Oh, that's what I needed. Look, this tower attacks using its fangs and permanently slows down fast enemies. Fast enemies start appearing around wave 30. Okay, so those super, super fast dudes, that's what I need because I can deploy that tower and it will pretty much like you know slow down those dudes ah yes okay well if you guys want to see another episode on this tower defense i would love to do so well i think we've done like four now which is pretty insane and you guys have absolutely loved every single one of them so but before you guys go definitely be sure to leave a like and continue on the legacy of tower defense on the unspeakable gaming channel and if you guys leave a like i'll do a part five i believe i think i've done five parts maybe four i'll do another part that's what i'll do thank you guys so much for watching i wish you all a safe and fantastic rest of your day and i'll see you guys tomorrow in a brand new video